Hey everybody and welcome back. We've got another TTM video to get to. We get autographs TTM or through the mail. We've got eight to get to today. See from the other view, this one a little bit broken open. That one's coming from North Texas. We'll see what that one's all about. Hopefully the cards are in good shape. But we send autographs through the mail. Cards, photographs. First one's coming from Pittsburgh, PA, and it's a T. We we know who this is. Could be Mr. Fine Print himself, the original, Frankie T. All right. I sent him a note and said I, I had the um, his photographs. Dear Michael, since I know you have the letter, I usually send to these to those who are collectors, but because. When you purchase the Sports Illustrated cover, I figure you still had it in case you were interested to purchase any other of my photos. I still do hope you have it in your files. If not, you will have to write and tell me that you threw it away. I am doing uh, okay. I'm just getting older. I really didn't, don't go anywhere, except for my doctor's appointments. My heart doctor does not want me to drive on the big highways. He says that he could take my license away from me, but he won't because the, something I won't listen, that I won't listen. <laughs> he said you can get into the post office and pharmacy and could trip take my demand mail to the post office mailbox i had hate being a burden on anyone i do not want to go somewhere to call and come get me take care michael and stay safe god bless you and take care of my guy sincerely frank thomas the original 1951 to 56 Always great to get a note from Frank Thomas. For some reason, I have ability to read his tiny little print. <laughs> Become a Frank Thomas interpreter. And I sent him the 60 tops. And he sent me this card, which has all of his stats on the back, including 286 home runs and nearly 1,000 RBIs. Really cool. Sends me his card. There's his phone number in case Troy Kernan wants to call him or... Raymond Melendez wants to call him. That's pretty cool. I like listening to those conversations. Frank Thomas, the original. He's five bucks. Always quick returns. That was back in a week. He's 93 years old. Played outfield, first base, third base. Five dollars a card, seven days. Next up from Cincy Nasty. The Queen City. Bob Trumpy. Rookie card, 1970, 1973. Hall of Famer. Really good player. Two-time AFL All-Star. Two-time Pro Bowl. Basically four times in a Pro Bowl. That's what that means. 4,600 yards receiving. 35 touchdowns. Then became a long-time broadcaster after his playing days. And that's how he made the Hall of Fame. As a broadcaster in the broadcaster's wing. We count that as a Hall of Famer. 77 years old now. He played tight end for 10 seasons for those Bengals. And that came back in almost two months. Uh, 40, 50, 56 days. No fee for the Hall of Famer, Bob Trumpy. Next up, this is the uh, ripped one. North Texas, Dallas, Texas. North Texas, Leroy Jordan. Three of three. Super Bowl Superman, 68 and 73. Ooh, I got a little card from the Leroy Jordan Lumber Company, I guess, for uh, just some backing. That's a pretty thick card. Didn't sign it. That's fine. Leroy, great, great linebacker. 81 years old now. Played 14 seasons. 60, let's see, 63 to 76. Super Bowl champ and Super Bowl five, five times in the Pro Bowl, borderline Hall of Famer. He's in the Cowboys Ring of Honor. 
and he's in the College Football Hall of Fame for his time at, oh, let me tell you about Alabama. <laughs> Nine days, no fee for the great Leroy Jordan. How about that? Next up, Miami, Miami, Florida. Ooh, there's uh, Leroy's uh, hated enemy, Billy Kilmer. Played for the Redskins during Leroy Jordan's era. 68 tops between the 49ers and the Saints. And then 73 tops on the Redskins. Cowboys and Redskins had great battles back then. But still do. He's 82 years old. He played for 18 seasons. 61 to 78. Two times an All-Pro for him. And he led the uh, NFL in passing touchdowns in 72. And passer rating. Same year. He's in the Redskins Hall of Fame and the Saints Hall of Fame. Passed for 20,000 plus yards and 150 TDs. He's in the College Football Hall of Fame for his time at UCLA. So he and Leroy are more than just contemporaries. And the same time, nine days as well for uh, Billy Kilmer. New Orleans. Nolens. Nolens, Louisiana. There's Archie Manning. I sent him two and he signed two. Woohoo! Love those, baby. Love those. 72 tops. Rookie card, Archie Manning. Who did we see get these back? Um, Chris and Chris. Chris and Chris cards, they're always getting great returns. They probably did get Archie. That's pretty cool. Nice sign, too. Took a little gamble there. Thinking, I don't know if he signs duplicates or not. Sent him two rookies. He's 73 years old. Of course, the father of uh, Eli and Peyton and the grandfather of Arch and uh, played for 14 seasons, 71 to 84, 12 of which for those Saints, two times in the Pro Bowl in the Saints Ring of Honor, Saints Hall of Fame. He passed for 24,000 yards and he's in the College Football Hall of Fame. Man, we're dominating College Football Hall of Famers. Where'd Bob Trumpy go to college? Utah. I wonder if he's in the College Football Hall of Fame. I doubt it. Next up, North Houston, Texas. Houston, Dallas, now we're in Houston. There's another Hall of Famer. There's a pro football Hall of Famer right there. Elvin Bethea. That's his rookie card, 70 tops. Then that Hall of Fame card is modeled after it. Inscribed both, Hall of Fame 03. Beautiful. Love getting that card back. And when he sends doubles, two for 10 all day long, Elvin Bethea. We've got him before, and he hasn't sent that extra card. It's like the third time we've got him. He sent the card. Second time he did not. Third time he did. That's a deal. He's 76 years old now. Hall of Fame, defensive end, 16 seasons. All these guys played around the same era. 68 to 83 for Elvin. Eight times in a Pro Bowl for him. Oilers Ring of Honor. 105 lifetime sacks. Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2003, as he says. And that's... Eight days. Eight days, $10 fee. Next up, Evansville, Indiana. Evansville, who is it? Carl Erskine? Phil Roof. Phil Roof, Phil Roof, Phil Roof, and Phil Roof, all four. 71, 77, 76, and 75. Beauty, eh? That's pretty cool. He's 81 years old. He caught for a while, too. 15 seasons. 61. Came up, and then he went back to the minors, 64 to 77. Then he was a bullpen coach for eight seasons. And then he became a manager in the twin system for another 15 years. So he's a baseball lifer. I got that back in exactly two weeks. 14 days, no fee for Phil Roof. Last one from Phoenix, Arizona. Last one today. Thanks for sticking with me. Make sure you subscribe. Notification bell, 89 score, Mark Malone. 16, Mark Malone. First time we've gotten him back. Sent that 89 score out. He's 63 years old, former quarterback for 10 seasons. 80 to 89. Then he became a uh, stunt double for Tom Selleck, Magnum P.I. Just kidding. <laughs> After his playing days, he was a sports uh, broadcaster for Pittsburgh, local Pittsburgh station where I grew up. And then he went national. I think he was on ESPN for a while, but he threw for 10,000 yards and about 60 touchdowns. 
And that's been out for a while. Let's see. 30, 40, plus 7, 47, plus 53 days. 53 days, no fee from Mark Malone. Signed one of one. Wow, look at all those rookies. Archie rookie, Trumpy rookie, Bethea rookie. And that's it. What do you think? Give me a thumbs up if you like what you see. And always, as I said, subscribe right there by clicking that icon just once. You just have to tap it. And then when you ring that bell, you'll be notified of all my future videos. And if you missed the last TTM video, I'll leave a link to that right there. You can watch it for yourself. Thanks for being with me today. We will see you soon.